Hey guys, what's going on? Today I have a short video on how to install LXC. Uh, this is part one of a series that I'll be doing on Linux containers and container-based technologies that have gained some attention over the past year or so. Uh, I'll be demoing on the newer, newly released CentOS 7 running in VirtualBox. If you enjoy this video, please stay tuned for new posts to the series or check out our blog at wickedawesometech.us. With that being said, let's begin. First thing you're going to want to do is grab a terminal. Um, if you're using GNOME, you can right click on the desktop, open terminal. Um, you need to switch to root to install the packages. Uh, one thing to note, um, LXC and all of its packages are actually under the EPL repository. The version of CentOS that I installed did not actually come with the EPL repository enabled. I'm not sure if any of them actually do. Um, so the first thing I'm going to do is use a little wget magic uh, to download the EPL RPM and do the installation from there. Okay, now I'll install the RPM. Now that it's installed, uh, let's go ahead and just verify that the EPL repository is enabled. Um, this might take a little bit to complete, so I'm going to go ahead and pause the recording. Okay, now we can see that the EPL repository is now enabled on our system, and now we are ready to install the main LXC package along with the, the bridging utilities for network. And that takes care of it guys uh, please stay tuned for um, more advanced configurations uh, in the next video thanks for watching